Ja, det var ingenting där. Ingenting. Det lättaste sättet att få upp två kilo protein på fjällen kan man ta med sig en pippelspö på 50 gram. Ja. Vad är det för bete? Det är maggot eller? I och för sig det väger lite grann. Det väger mer än själva spö. Middag för en. En okej matfisk. Ja, behöver några till. Ja. Den börjar frysa på så vi ska äta den ikväll så tänkte jag ska stoppa in den innan fina tröjan. Låt den ligga mot huden där. Ja, de är fina. Fin färg på dem. Ja, det är så orange röd. Vi ska få två där vi ser till. Ja. Frusigt. Ja. 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 
tell I'm very deep in snow here. So. Oh God! Crap! Man, it's my shunt that man can some have a little place to sit in these big rocks that man can some. Ah, it's very nice. Quite nice actually. It's been a little windy, been snowing all night. It's been somewhere between minus 10 and minus 20. Uh, using the Onion GT2. Um, yeah, it's not actually a winter tent and there's a lot of, how would you say, negatives to using it as a winter tent. Uh, for example, it's got these big catery cuts on it, which allows in snow and wind, so it's not as tight as your proper winter tent. It doesn't have top ventilation, uh, but it does have double opening doors, so you could easily make top ventilation. Some of the storms I've had this in have been pretty impressive, uh, even for Swedish standards. So it's just become like... Uh, one of my preferred winter tents. I use this one and I use uh, the Sodic Mid as well if I want to get really light. It's been a nice trip up here around uh, Marsfjell. It's in northern Sweden around Skittefjell uh, area. It's uh, just quite nice to get out. But normally I don't come out in February just because it gets dark so early. But uh, we have <coughs> access to a uh, Stuga not too far away, 
So it's been kind of nice to just be in there for that six hours of darkness before it was time to go to bed, or six or seven, and hang out with Christian and Marcus, and we just kind of relax and chit chatted and so on. And then it was time to go to bed. We all went our separate ways. So nice to come out, and I, I actually prefer to sleep in a tent, uh, even when it's minus 20, as long as I have proper gear. You know, it's kind of nice to just hang out and that cold helps me sleep a little better. Using the uh, Thermarest Polar Ranger, just a fantastic sleeping bag. One of the best winter bags I've used. Packs down real nice. Uh, got the zipper here and it's got the two armholes and actually I've got my, there's a little hoodie that you put on top of it. Uh, it's just kind of a nice little sleeping bag when in the morning you don't feel like getting dressed just yet. So you can just stick your arms out the holes here and <coughs> just kind of relax and get the muscles moving. You know, I notice the older I get, the slower my muscles get. So I have to kind of warm them up a little. <coughs> 